WFNN Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of rainy and chilly Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 2 p.m. update. Currently, all the U.S. indices trading to the upside. The Dow's up 284 points, eight tenths percent, one and uh, three tenths of percent for the S&P, 59 points, one and seven tenths for the NDX 100, 252 points, one and six tenths for the Russell, 31 points the upside. Semis are up nearly three percent, 2.8 percent to be exact that's a uh, hundred points the upside trend is up one and six tenths percent we've got a rally going on it looks like a rally that should continue and the reason we say that is spot politics is below its 50-day exponential moving average gold is rallying it's up eight bucks silver's up 12 pennies lights we crude up 23 cents in the 30 years treasury trade out at 153.10 first let's go take a look at what's going on in the index etfs as of two o'clock with two more hours left in the trading session you've got the spies trading in the swing point from uh, february Second, that swing point had 117 million shares. You've only got 47. You're trading into a light volume. The queue is doing the same thing, trading into a swing point that has 78 million with 35 million shares with two hours left to go. The diamonds price is trading just slightly above its swing point, which would confirm or suggest an A to B equal CDT upside. Really wouldn't be confirmed from a volume standpoint because the volume on that swing point is 8.9 million. You're at 3 million shares as we speak right now. And the IWM, which looks like that's going to close above 203. 90, the B point of an A to B equals CD to the upside, uh, but it also has light volume. 42 million on the swing point and only 18 million shares as we speak right now. Let's switch from this and go take a look at our indice charts out here. As we do that, you'll see the Dow in the upper left-hand corner. Now, the Dow trading above the top of that swing point suggests either an A to B equals CD to the upside or move up to its TD9 breakdown level of 36,513. The SPY's not taking out that swing point, but if they do, that suggests to move up to 47.44, where price is broken down. The NDX 100, not taking out the swing point, but if it does, then a move to 15.990, the TD9 breakdown level would make sense. Russell 2000 already above that swing, that suggests a move to 22.10 or that area. The Russell or the spot, the uh, semis do have a confirmed A to B equals CD to upside. They are traded above their swing point with volume. So you've got a confirmed A to B equals CD, confirmed a, a TD9 count pattern at the lows. This looks like it wants to target to 38.40. 95 level. It's TD9 breakdown level out here. Spot volatilix is very likely headed to 1794. You've got an A to B equals CD pattern in the XAU, very likely targeted to 138 area. That is its most recent profile high. Folks, stay tuned. David White is up next with the Power Trading Hour. I'll see you back here tomorrow on Terrific Thursday. Have a wonderful Wednesday, folks.